Just in time for Christmas, a new access road has been laid to an ancient monastery in the Judean hills, allowing pilgrims to reach the site. One of the world's oldest and most breathtaking churches in the Holy Land, the cliff-hanging St. George Monastery had been virtually cut off for the past three years, ever since an earthquake and flooding destroyed the road. Built in the 5th century, around a cave where Christians believe the prophet Elijah sought shelter, now the Greek Orthodox Patriarch sought help from the Israeli government to reconnect the site to civilization. Israel's tourism ministry and other government bodies put up the half a million dollars to renovate the road. Joyous pilgrims readily accepted rides down the steep road in wagons driven by the monks. Once inside, they were able to worship and view the skeletal remains of St. George. Ever since Moses, Jesus, and Elijah communed with God in the wilderness, people have sought out the purifying solitude of the desert. Now the monks who came in search of pious solitude are certain to be deluged with busloads of pilgrims and tourists. This is Felice Friedson for the Media Line.